Okay, congratulations. You just won a Shorty Award. How do you feel? Oh my gosh, so surprised. Yeah? Like, J.K. Rowling and Elizabeth Gilbert are like two of my favorite authors, so I really thought there was no chance, but I just thought it would be fun to come and see everybody and kind of fangirl about all the other people that were here. <laughs> so I totally did not think this was going to happen, so it's a wonderful thing. I feel very, very, very honored and happy. You have a lot of books under your belt. I do. Any, any that are coming up that we don't know about? No, I'm working on one right now. So this oh. is actually a very nice thing because it's been kind of a hard trudge. So, you know, it's a little... Uh, you would think after 12 books that you would know what you're doing and that you would feel like you have the system down. But it actually, for me, it's getting harder and harder every book. Yeah. I think just because you're kind of competing with what you already did and... You know, so I and I don't want to repeat myself. So this is such a nice thing. Like it just makes me feel better. It also makes me feel like I'm not wasting all my time on social media. You know, like because a lot of times I feel like if I'm on social media, I'm not working. But now I'm working. See, it paid off. <laughs> You're cultivating an audience. What's so cool is that you kind of base a lot of your books off of some of your own personal experiences and feelings. Is that why people connect? I think so, and I think it's also just the idea of high school. Like, whether you had a great time in high school or whether you were miserable, people don't tend to forget that time in their lives. I don't meet very many people that have, like, no feelings at all about high school. And maybe you don't want to think about it when you're first getting out. It's the last thing you want to think about, but I think that's why YA is so popular now. It's like when you're at a safe distance in your 20s and 30s, you're ready to think back to that time in your life and maybe deal with it. I actually read a, a study one time that said people carry their 16-year-old selves with them their entire lives. They can't let go of it. Oh, I feel, and I feel that way here tonight because I was like the biggest loser. Like I never won anything. So it's like, oh my gosh, this is so exciting. My 16-year-old self would never believe it. <laughs> you are anything but. You are a big winner. Thank you for all of your beautifully written words and for coming tonight. Oh, it's so fun. I'm so glad I'm here. Thank you. It was Congrats. Wonderful. All right, thank you. <laughs> Bottom line, I create stars on the internet. And if you're a star on the internet, then you're at the Shorty Award!